Princess Katharina Amalia of Netherlands joined her parents Queen Maxima and King Willem Alexander on their long-awaited royal tour to the Caribbean territories of Netherlands. The Dutch royals who were on the royal flight with King Willem Alexander as the captain when it touched down in Bonaire Airport on Friday. This is Princess Amalia's first royal tour abroad after turning 18 years old last year. She looked amazingly beautiful in a flowery light blue Nathan dress, a gold ring, Lingard earrings, and chimney sunglasses. She portrayed her mother's elegance. Queen Maxima shone with her cornflower blue blazer and a white crepe trouser while the king wore a light brown coat, white shirt, black trouser, and brown shoes. The royals looked great. They were received at the official residence by Governor Edison Rijna, executive and members of the council. They will also visit Curaçao, Aruba, St. Martin, St. Eustatius, and Saba. The royal tour is up for 14 days in the six Caribbean islands. From Netherlands, they were accompanied by the Secretary of State's Relation and Digitalization Alexandra Van Huffelen. On their second day in the Caribbean islands, Princess of Orange was inducted into the Banarian culture. She joined her parents King and Queen of Netherlands together with the community for the traditional dance where she made a little shaking of the body. It was a great event as the dancers dressed in the traditional dance attires and were in good jovial mood. Holding on to the royals as they danced off their backs together. The blonde princess also got to observe the cooking of the locals, performance by the young children and they also mingled together sharing stories to learn a few things. This will be good for her as she will get into the bottom of the culture of the of kingdom. Although the crown princess is not more enthusiastic about the visit as was expected, hopefully, with time and more tours she will have learned what's expected in the visits. The sassy princess was also introduced into the colonial history of the country. They were shown around the slave huts located in Wit Pan. She looked relaxed and ready to learn more about the history of slavery on her future territory. Her choice of dress and high heels even though looking great on her, was not convenient for her walk around. The Dutch princess took a short break from school to carry out her first royal tour abroad. She studies history, politics and psychology at the University of Amsterdam. The main aim of the royal trip is to introduce her to her constituent kingdoms of Netherlands, to learn more about those Caribbean territories as she is the future queen. The Princess of Orange has a lot to catch up with now that she is of age and can carry out royal duties on her own. What should we expect from the princess? Leave a comment below. If you are new to this channel, kindly subscribe, like, share and comment for more royal updates. Thanks for watching.